What's up everybody? I am here with some more Assassin's Creed 3 Tyranny of King Washington. Last time, uh, we finally made it to Boston. And uh, we and also we actually gained another new power, which is Eagle Flight. So now, uh, we faced Washington in the last episode, and we barely got him uh, close to death. When, well, not really. But uh, so now we are here at the next mission, uh, meeting uh, Sam Adams or... Yeah, Sam Adams, or Samuel Adams, one, one of the allies. But before we actually get to the next mission, uh, over here, well, this is the entire city of Boston. It looks kind of different. Well, well, it is. It is different because over here, this is actually a new area. Over here, and they kind of expanded that and that. So they, but technically, they actually made Boston different. So there's actually a big area. Boston is not a big area, not like in the main game where Boston is just this little section over here. That's where I'm pointing at now. Over here, now before we actually get in towards uh, the main mission, uh, I want to head towards over here. Add a artifact. As you can see, this is in the main game, where Connor was still young, and this is where I believe the Boston Massacre was held. I'm right about it. But that was the one thing I did wanted to show. There was another artifact mo uh, memory back in episode one, but I never, I never actually uh, activated it due to uh, the the cutscene of Putnam. We'll be trapped in this alley if Franklin comes with reinforcements. Like last time. But then I get done. I told you're an extraordinary hunter. You'd track anything or anyone. I'd do my best. I could use such a man. I fought for years in the cause of freedom. I thought that Washington would lead us to a new age. But he turned. I had to start again. Sadly, our second rebellion is faltering. Sir, we're out of gunpowder. leave Boston. We'll be crushed altogether. I wish to free some comrades to bring with us. The loyal boys, all of them. But this time, we must avoid being surprised by that murderer, Franklin. If I had a man, to track Franklin down while we attempt to free our friends. That would disorient the Bluecoats and ensure our success. I have my own reasons to give Franklin. Capital. We have an accordance of desires. From time to time, we get important information from this Tavern, right here. Your appearance draws attention. But if you were able to mingle with the denizens, you should be able to discover Franklin's movements. I like how it's vice versa. Uh, we, in the main game, we fought with the blue coats and we fought against the red coats. Now it's the other way around. We're allying with the red coats, which was the British at the time. During the American Revolution? Yeah, yeah. Which was the British or the French? So now I like it how it's the other way around. So now we're allying with the red coats and we're and we're fighting against the blue coats. Let's knock this guy out. Now maneuvering around through Boston is actually a bit more difficult due to the fact that uh, there are more uh, blue coats in the rooftops and there's more uh, blue coats in the streets too which makes it a little bit more difficult to actually maneuver around here but before we actually do that uh, one thing I one thing I do like about uh, I do about I, I do like about the new uh, Eagle flight is that uh, you use a little of your energy or a little bit of your health. That's one thing I actually like about it. Got their asses. I 
how we gotta fight these guys. Get out of there! Ah, oh, damn. Damn! Just face planted the guy. As you can see in the minimap right there, look how many blue coats are, look how many enemies there are there. That's why I say it's a little bit more difficult to actually maneuver around around the city of Boston. Now I still can't believe there is still the pick uh, pick locking mechanic. And I hate it and I hate it so much. That's why in my personal file it took so long to actually get every little chest that was around through the frontier and throughout Boston. Now, as you uh, open chests, or well, yeah, as you open the chest throughout the frontier and throughout uh, Boston, you will unlock uh, weapons. As you can see, the bigger chests here, the treasures, the bigger treasures that have the lock, these have equipment, which is uh, new swords, new guns, uh, new uh, blunt weapons that you can actually unlock. And over here, uh, the small chests actually uh, include. Um, Mostly consumable items like ammo, bait, uh, snares. I think there's snares here. No, uh, rope darts, uh, bows, ammunition, poison darts, and uh, raw meat to the, actually distract the dogs. So that's kind of the two differences between the chests that have the key on them and the uh, treasures. The only main difference is, of course, uh, with with these uh, ch treasure chests is that you have to actually do the pick locking mechanic which actually kind of sucks but with the regular ones you don't have to so that's the main difference so if you do want to actually get new equipment then you're gonna have to do that but if you want to get consumable items either just uh, kill enemies or just uh, find one of those chests It's funny how they don't attack us, which that one should be in a slave camp. They gotta kick me out. Well, Ouch! Anyone okay. want to play? I'll take on all comers. Care for a game? It's much better than cards, <laughs> don't you think? I remember. Hey. We... I am trying to concentrate. I'm just being sociable. Whoosh. If I move, you're gonna. Uh, no, move this piece over here. Jiminy, old Franklin's sending me out with another message. Oh, you're in for it now. And here's the worst of it. The message is for Putnam. Christ, you're a dead mackerel. Right. With either of those two, there's always some reason to end up flogged. Franklin will give you the lash, and then Putnam will try to outdo him. Something big is up. Only one ale for me. I have to get this to Putnam's lieutenant, or it's the whip. Or maybe worse. Wow, I actually kind of got, I got lucky in the optional objective. Due to the fact that uh, it actually took me several tries to actually do that. But, get inside, need to restore some health. Thank you. I hate it how you, when you activate your ability at the wolf cloak, uh, you actually have to get out of the haze. There we go.
General Putnam, there appears to be a misunderstanding regarding our respective positions and authorities. A personal meeting is called for at the docks tomorrow, 10 at night. The usual sentinels will secure our safety. Yours, Ben Franklin. If Putnam doesn't get this message, I will miss my chance to trap Franklin. I must return it to the messenger's satchel. Oh, jeez. So now this is actually kind of the tricky part. Uh, due to you actually gotta find the guy. So. So what we gotta do is... Head up. And actually find, put back the letter. Um, ah, there he is. Now what we have to do is... Ah, he's going this way. Ah, fancy him. Get down on the grass. Finally, woo! So now we gotta head towards this big boat. Ah, and here's another chest. Travel. Let's open this one. Okay, we got one arrow. Two guys there. Oh no! Ah, oh, it. Get down now! So you gotta kill the other one before the time limit. Got him. Now that part could be actually be a little tricky. General Putnam is unable to meet with you. What? Well, this is absurd. Washington will hear of this. King Washington. His Majesty has removed himself to New York City to deal with the rebellion festering there. Removed himself? Why wasn't I informed? General Putnam asked me to deliver this proclamation from the King. This attests that Israel Putnam is heretofore to... What is this? From now on, you take orders from Putnam. 
me take orders from him. I suggest you show me some respect, sir, or I'll have these men shoot you down. Sentinels! Sentinels, but... Now there's my cue. Damn, got him in the throat. But wait, I got him. Oh, I I show up. Sick I I've I have pressed the right trigger instead of the left. God damn it. How is he still running? Got him. Hold still. Ah, gotta hurt. Come with me. Monster. It was as if Washington had some some great power. Come on. He, he clouded my mind. He, he I don't want to hear it. Come with me. Are you taking me somewhere to be killed? But but I can help you now. Need back into a secure area. You have to understand. It was as if my very thoughts were controlled. I simply could not think for myself. Keep moving. Don't kill me. Not now that I've come to my senses. Let me get him in here. I've got a deadline on it. Oh, come on. Oh, left bumper. Sorry. I pressed the right one. Gosh, these animals do your bidding. This is astonishing. Yeah, I possess powers. Far beyond your understanding. I let you live. My only wish is to atone for my wickedness. I will devote every moment to destroying the king. How, my dear man? I can be of enormous benefit. I served at Washington's side. I know his habits quite well. We will speak to Adams about this. Return to sender. A betrayal. Thanks. Mission complete. Full synchronization. Kind of interesting. But I'm not going for full synchronization due to the fact that it would just take forever. And I don't want to... Because I already, I, I've been in Assassin's Creed for like two months now. Even though I completed the main game about a month ago. It's because, you know, I don't have the time for it. You know, I don't have the time to actually complete it because, of course, I'm back in school. So that's one of the reasons why. But anyway, uh, I'm just going to end. So it's been almost 20 minutes now, but I'm just going to end it off, off here. So next time on Assassin's Creed 3, Tyranny of King Washington, we're going to be doing the next mission, Man of Metal. Whatever that means. Until next time.